Okay guys, so welcome back to another video. I'm filming on my phone because my camera is dead at the moment, so you guys get landscape view. But it's on the 15 Pro, so it should be pretty good quality. Um, we went to Starbucks, but it's the day after the show. I'm just gonna be filming literally everything I eat today. So Starbucks dropped their holiday menu, which I'm excited for because there's new coffees out. Did, I think, what did I get? It's the gingerbread oat chai. Yeah, that's what I got. So I got the gingerbread oat chai latte, and then we also got the gingerbread loaf, little cake, little cakey cake, because we're back on prep tomorrow, which is so fun to think about. But oh, this looks so good. Okay. You gotta write the new coffee. Oh my god. Do you want a small sip of it? Yes. It's so good. Maria's getting ready, you guys. I need to see Maria. Say hello. Can I also mommy? <laughs> she getting kind of shredded. Sheesh. Okay, one it's sip. So good. Mm. I say it's like a nine out of ten. <gasps> this is dangerous. You gotta take this away. They'll still have them after your show. Isn't it good? That's really good. Yeah. That's really good. <laughs> so you're rating one out of ten. I say nine. I give it a solid nine. That's really good. So guys, there's a, you can get it hot or you can get it iced. It's a gingerbread oat chai latte. That's what it is. And then we got the loaf cake, which I'm excited for this. Gingerbread anything is like my fucking jam during the holidays. Oh yeah, this is good. Two gingerbread things for the gingerbread man. Ginger, ginger man ginger the ginger man. man. <laughs> this is so good. Oh my god. Is that funny? me eating it because people like to watch people eat. I was just going to be sped up. Yeah. I was going to say, I really, uh, you really got roasted by one of my girlfriends. Well, I got roasted. You're my, uh, you're my lucky charm at the end of the rainbow. <laughs> That's so fucked. Does she think I'm short too? And I said, he's magically delicious. <laughs> oh my God. So this is probably gonna be pre-workout because we're gonna go back to the Airbnb and then get dressed and go with everyone. Yeah. So I made my cream of rice bowl. Um, I'm so out of it. Don't let YouTube down. I'm not. Okay. <laughs> I have 90 grams. I have the bowl of gains. I actually brought it in, so I'll show you guys. We have the peaches and cream one. I did 90 grams of this. There's two scoops of the peanut butter Jack Factory protein powder. And then I have the honey nuts and more. I'll put the calories and the macros up. I wanna, I'm curious to see what I get up to today. You should track it on my fitness pal and put the... Yeah. It'll be up for this first meal. It'll, I'll put it up before for Starbucks too. But this is meal one. And I'm also gonna eat this little, it's a Nito. It's like a... It's like a, oh, it says right here. It's a filled sweet baked good. It's like a Mexican baked good. One of the competitors I'm friends with and that I competed with, he gave it to me yesterday, so I'm gonna try it. So we're gonna eat this and then get ready for the gym, which I'm a time lapse while we eat. Chicken. Uh. 
Like I said, use code Maria. <laughs> use code Maria. Do you put your... Oh. <laughs> I put, yeah, I put the... Your code Danilo for your... Yeah, I'll put the link down below for Megafit. Time you time lapse, time lapse it like this instead of clicking time lapse. Well, I can when I put it on Premiere Pro, I can just like put the duration shorter, or like put the duration down. Guys, so these are from Nut, Nut and Bananas. It's like a banana bread company. But I have a code with them now, so use code Danilo at checkout. The link will be down below. But guys, they're amazing. Like, they're phenomenal. They're so, so good. I'm about to smash a slice of this. This is my breakfast. Yeah? Don't eat the whole fucking loaf. Breakfast of chicken. Try it. No, no banana bread for me. I'm just met it. Oh my god, it's so gooey. Look at it. That's dripping. Mm. And through dripping. That looks so good. I'm here for the smells. Mm. Oh, so good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's not fair. Wow. Yeah, it's like so nice to recharge. So yeah, just being my puppy. Yeah, no, I feel it. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> ready? Another one. Pre-workout. Pre-workout. Mm. Okay, we go now. I don't know how many calories this is. How are you gonna put the macros on the screen? Mom's banana bread, zero calories. Oh, Anabolic with zero calories. And your mom's food, zero calories, always. Mm -hmm. Okay guys, so <clears throat> we just got out of the gym. Um, I've only had really basically one meal today. So right now we are going to have a little bit of chicken and rice. And then we have the drive through sauce from Flavor Gang. But we're also going to have some banana bread with it. My mom made five loaves of banana bread, you guys. <laughs> I don't know how many calories are in it. I'm gonna put everything up on the screen, obviously. But there's really five whole loaves here, so I'm gonna set everything up and then I'll show you guys the whole little meal set up. So honestly, since that post-workout meal, I have not really eaten anything. I've just been kind of chilling. Um, I just got some client work done, but I am hopping on here because I'm eating a banana. So I'll put the total calories up right now of what we're at for today. Um, I don't know where we're going to go have dinner at because it's 5.50 right now. Might go to a burger spot. I don't really know yet. I don't know what I'm wanting or craving I just kind of got all my cravings out of the way I mean I know they're gonna come right back 
just being back in prep soon. Um, but yeah, it might not be the most exciting full day of eating, but I guess I'm going to eat banana bread and then, oh, I didn't show the little roll I ate. I ate this little like Mexican like filled like chocolate roll. I'll put like a picture of it up on the screen of what it is. All the calories, like I said, all the calories after this banana, I'll put like right here, just so you guys can see everything that I ate. But we're keeping it moderate because we ate a decent bit yesterday. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna eat this banana right now and then I'll keep you guys updated here soon if we eat anything else. All right, y'all, I'm about to take down this motherfucking carrot cake cookie from Barbell's Bake Shop. Guys, these cookies are phenomenal. I am excited for this because we go to dinner here soon, but I did just want to try this. Ooh. I did just want to try this. I'm not going to eat the whole thing. I'm going to give the rest to Prob. Prob and Nav, but I want to try this out, like I said, guys. It's from Barbell Bake Shop. This is her carrot cake cookie. Oh, guys. Like I said, it's our last, it's our last two rods tonight before we get back on prep. So, I want to show you guys. Oh, guys, it's like, it's like falling apart. Y'all. Carrots and there's nuts in it. Mm -hmm. It's not overly sweet either. It's not overly sweet. This is really good. So guys, we go back on prep tomorrow, so we're getting in what we can. Mm-hmm. And like I said, her cookies are not overly sweet, <clears throat> so when you eat it, it's like it doesn't feel like it's like a lot. <clears throat> but like I said, I'm gonna pop up a picture right now. It's called Barbell Bake Shop. Her cookies are phenomenal. She's a brand new company. Go support her, you guys. These things are amazing. I've also had the, so that was the carrot cake one. That's like a 9.5 out of 10. I had a lemon bar one after my show. I think that one beats the carrot cake, which is crazy to say because I love carrot cake stuff. But the lemon bar one, that was a 10 out of 10. So, all right, we're going to kick our feet up, chill out. We'll see you guys soon when we have more food. A little snacky snack. Calories.
You gotta cut that bee. I'm excited. So what are you what are you doing right now? So guys, <laughs> we're back on sushi. Um, the sushi was. What did you give it? <laughs> Wait, you're holding the knife and looking at me. I'm a little worried. I'm gonna back up. Just <laughs> serious. We had the sushi and it was like a seven point five. It was good. It wasn't like. Tell the people that you didn't finish the sushi. <laughs> oh yeah, I ordered. I, I ordered way too much, you guys. They brought out the second plate and I was like, I'm not finishing this. So there's sushi in there for tomorrow, but we have a pumpkin cinnamon roll cookie from Megalicious. And this is the first time trying her company. So we're gonna cut it and it's a little warm. Oh, oh my God. What? No, I said don't do that. Like, don't look at that. Oh, yeah. Don't Viewer's look. discretion advised. <laughs> oh my Can god. Can you not do that? Huh? As he continues to lick. Oh, this is dangerous. Okay, go ahead. Do your thing. Do your thing. That was you. That was you. <laughs> I can't wait till you can eat these. With me. I know, I know. I'm eating through you right now. <laughs> the look on your eyes. What are you rating this cookie out of 10? It's a little zoom up in the pants. That is so good. That's that food porn right here. <laughs> you can all the angles. What? I don't know. Angles. That's so good. Guys. This is really, this is like. I have three other flavors from her too. There's a banana cream pie, there's a Boston cream pie, and then there's like a pumpkin, just like a normal pumpkin one. That looks delicious. This is like a 10 out of 10. Wow. This is really good. 10 out of 10? I'll figure out what the calories are for this and I'll put it up for the whole day. Non-existent calories. Non-existent. Yeah, this is good. This is All right, YouTube family, so, um, it is the next day after our little free day of eating yesterday. And honestly, guys, like I said, I didn't really go too, too wild. Um, just because obviously we have the next show here in five and a half weeks, but I just wanted to, well, five weeks, we're five weeks out. Um, but Nick did tell me that, um, we're not really going back on full plan until Monday. So, I basically get the weekend. He's like, you know, I trust you with you, you know, eating untracked food, like all this stuff. So he knows I'm not going to go crazy and just absolutely mess everything up. Like I'm still vascular, veiny. I'm still shredded. Like I'm a little watery, which is normal. Um, but I'm also needing to get my body more rest. And just with the Olympia Expo this week and everything, like after this weekend, like that water retention will come off. Um, so we just get to enjoy ourselves the next couple of days. Just relax. Um, give our body a break before going back into prep. Um, the plan is to push hard for, we're only pushing hard for two out of the five weeks. Um, just because we've been in prep for so long, you guys, but the Road to Pro series is not over. It's not over yet, you guys. Um, like I said, we got five weeks to make the changes we need to make to make sure that we have a pro-worthy physique. And I will tell you right now, we're going to make that happen. There's no doubt in my mind about it. It wasn't my day at the Amateur Olympia, and that's okay. But it is what it is. Things like that happen. And things like that are going to, they're honestly going to make or break you. You can either sit there, like I said, and you know you can bitch and whine and complain about it. Or you can get back up on your feet, do what you need to do, and get things done. So we're heading to the expo, which I'm going to see how much content I can get for the Olympia weekend. Guys, there's so much footage. Like... When you're seeing this video, there's all the past footage that I have posted, obviously. But, guys, I got I got my work cut out for me this weekend. There's a lot, a lot to edit and film, which will keep me busy, you know, these last five weeks of prep. So, I really hope you all enjoyed the video. There will be a huge, a huge cheat day post-nationals. You best believe that because Maria, which we'll touch on in another video a little bit more, but Maria's show 
is the weekend after nationals. So she'll be competing literally the weekend after I get done. So we'll enjoy some food that night, but then we fly back out to Tampa the next morning because we have to get settled and get her ready for her show. Um, so yeah, guys, lots of fun things to come to the channel. I want to save it because I don't want to spoil anything. But I hope you all enjoyed the video. Remember to leave a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. It helps me out a lot. Follow me on Instagram if you guys don't already. Um, I do obviously post there a lot. You guys will get updated the most there. Um, but more content coming your way here very soon. So I hope you all have a beautiful day, morning, night, whatever time you're watching this. And I'll see you in the next video. It's time to go to Olympia, baby. First one ever.